Hello there, YouTube. In my last vid, I was trying to figure out what sort of oscillator I had made, and I accidentally stumbled upon the simplest, I don't know how old it is, but the simplest and pretty common uh, blocking oscillator. I'll put a link in the description. And I was having some fun with this transformer, powering its coils and getting a tiny little arc off of it. And I decided, what other transformer can I connect? Eh, that didn't work so well. <laughs> but this little guy, out of a DVD player, works awesome. It's crazy. Um, yeah. Drawn two amps. Look at the arc on that. Oh man. And yeah, it's basically how this oscillator works is it uh, saturates the core, then getting a voltage out of there blocks the power going to the base. Basically, like, it's very similar to a uh, Jewel Thief, except a lot higher powered. And I had connected it properly, so I don't burn out all my resistors. I was doing it the improper way and very inefficient. Um, so right now I've got a resistor here and a capacitor. Those are in parallel. That's uh, orange, white, red. Something in the what? 5 to 10k range. And then this capacitor is what? Uh, couple hundred picofarads and yeah works quite well the transistor gets meh a little warm and that turns on a little bit the uh, fluorescent light bulb there and as you can see sort of see it was drawn about two amps on the uh, from the power supply. Um, oh yeah, got rid of my old contactor thing because when I would switch it off, because it was drawing about one and a half to two amps, this would then be uh, given a high output. But when I switched it off, it would continue doing that but then the voltage would rise so it would trip the over voltage protection in it so I just let's do the green wire there and then the ground which is the enable pin on the transformer and yeah um, oh yeah I was I had this hooked up in this configuration and I was actually arcing inside this core and I would get nothing really on the output but it would just smell of ozone and you can hear it sparking and so I thought that was pretty funny and this don't know if I said this already, but it's a out of a DVD player. 
got like what six volts and uh, twelve volts with a center tap to ground. And I think they're both going in the same way. They're just different numbers of turns. And this is the primary. So yeah, I thought that was really cool and some impressive arcs from this tiny little transformer. Quite amazed how it doing so well. So, so let's arc it out some more. Zener on. That Zener. Fluorescent. As you can see, the voltage, the current drops when I'm arcing. It just goes right up. So it's really inefficient when it's not arcing, which is strange. And I can smell the ozone. Thanks for watching guys, have fun.